Ahoy! What's up good people? Captain Chris here coming to you live from the shipyard in Grenada. I'm gonna make a quick film of what exactly a hurricane cradle is. As you can see the the cradle is in a star type of pattern and it's all connected. So if you look down at the keel down where the kayak is you'll see the metal coming out and it's all connected up into the poppet or the stand however you want to look at it. So I think um, what this probably prevents is a sinking of an individual stand because it's spread out over a large surface area, the load is. Whereas if you look at this stand right here on the front, it does not distribute the load very well. I mean it distributes across three legs but not in the pattern that you can see with the cradle. So Krista weighs about 22,000 pounds and that is spread out over the entire piece of metal which I think is good. So without uh, further ado let's shift gears here to a little disturbing thing that we've discovered that's going to cost some time and some money and that is the replacement of the chain plates. Uh, I've identified a crack in one of them and I believe the chain plates are probably close to 15 years old. So on the starboard side, right up there, you can see where the rust has dripped down or bleed, bled, whatever the term is, down the hull. That usually spells trouble. So when I come back, I'm going to have to bring along some chain plates with me and I, end, I might end up having to replace the trying to get a better view of it what they call the cross piece which is that piece of metal that it goes across the wooden boomkins and that is connected to the uh, baby stays so uh, I'll have the yard do an acid wash on the hull I'm going to order some new stickers I'm gonna order stickers for the hull and get rid of the paint that says Chris on San Francisco looks looks terrible so that's it from Grenada and uh, it's extremely hot, I mean brutal. And at night, the mosquitoes come out in droves and I gotta close all the hatches. So I'm looking forward to getting in into some air conditioning and getting home. So that's it from Grenada. Later.